Hi folks, this episode we talk on remembrance power. Every human being has a brain which has a huge remembrance power. There is no word of this guy doesn't have any remembrance power, no. It's strong. Everyone has the same power, same brains. If you're talking truth, you need not remember anything. And if you're not able to train your brain for remembering it, then you can't remember it. So remembrance power is all about how you train and how you remember the things. With the remembrance power, you'll have the intelligence and behavior and the confidence. You'll have a lot many skills will be depending on this. And there are different types of things in it. For example, short term memory, sensory memory, long term memory. In the short term memory, you can remember things in very short term. For example, the phone number. You can divide the phone number of 10 numbers, 5 into chunk, 1 chunk into other, other chunk. 98480-12345. If you remember 9840, that will remember and again 12345. That's the short term memory. And the sensory memory is how you sense it reading hearing it's all called sensory memory if you can hear well if you can see well you can remember the things very well and the third one is long-term memory in the long term you can store a lot of information for long term there are different methods to practice long term for example mnemonic devices Say for example, in all the Mughal kings, if you want to remember all the kings' names, Bhajna, that's the word mnemonic. Babar, Humayun, Akbar, Jahangir, Nawab, Shah Jahan, Aurangzeb. That's how we can remember the names. And the next method in the long, long term memory is a rhyme method. Ek do teen, char panche, saat, aat, nao, das, gyara. So that the kids can remember all the Hindi numerics and the next method you can say is rote method R-O-T-E where you can have small acronyms so if you are going to for a shopping in the supermarket if you remember the word stop S for soap T for toothbrush O for orange juice P for paste that's how we can remember the things for your shopping so there are different methods in generating and improving your remembrance. So concentrate well in hearing, concentrate well when you are speaking. And as you practice it well, you can remember a lot of things, the complete dictionary also. And one more simple method is read, repeat, recite, and remember. Read the things, repeat it, recite it. You can remember things very well. So improve your remembrance power by practicing these things. See you in the next episode.